I would like to speak about uh, robotic process automation, RPA. Uh, I think RPA is a complement to IDEM Pierre that we need to know what exactly is. There are many definitions about RPA. You can see on Google, if you uh, write RPA on Google, you have some this kind of definition, this kind, this kind, this kind, and this kind. But in reality, there are only, you must be remember in your mind, it's only f free, free word. This is a software for manual activity and repetitive tasks. And you can add, it's computer coded software the automat manual activity by performing repeating tasks, world task. This is the definition, simple definition. We ex exactly mean what is RPA. I don't know if many bo everybody know what is it RPA uh, and use it maybe in, in some uh, in some uh, in some uh, in some country. How it does work? It's replicate human interaction and operate an, in the user interface layer GUI. You can use GUI to, uh, to the robot can use GUI to, to create some things. You read application like uh, uh, ERP, IDMPR, ERP, and can be implemented at the desktop or in the virtual environment. I would like to show you a demo to fix approximately what is it. Uh, and the demo try to show you this kind of thing. Maybe we can make differ differently, but uh, you can imagine what is it. The process uses a robot to push PDF attachment from an email inbox. So this is the first step, the first, uh, the first seconds. The data of each PDF is then transported to, to the row on the master Excel document where it's saved on the machine. Then the robot logs into the web system application like it, IDMPR and the data from each record of the Excel document is entered into RRP and generate order invoice. And finally, when it is finished, designed users are notified that the process is complete. It's just a repetitive task, uh, and uh, you can see, if you, uh, you imagine you receive some order by PDF on, on email, you must be open PDF, look all the information on the PDF, Put uh, connect on Idempierre. Uh, put uh, uh, create each order, uh, each order uh, one after one, and uh, repeat for another PDF, another PDF. This is repetitive task that you can have, and maybe you can use a robot to make this. I show you the demo. This is a, a small small film. It's, it's made by Deloitte. It does not use Idempierre, but you can imagine that the connection that it makes is to Idempierre.
This is, uh, I don't see if you see on the demo, but you can imagine what you can make with repetitive tasks that you have uh, frequently when you uh, will try to, to implement uh, Ida and Pierre. Frequently, you cannot, you can make something with uh, REST and uh, OSOP, uh, web, web services, you can, you can automatic, automatize, <coughs> automat, automat some, some different tasks but each time that you need to, uh, or each change you have, you must be rewrite aga again the code and the code and so on. With, with uh, RPA, you can, uh, you can use easily the, the system. What, what you have seen? You have seen, you, you can see the, the capability of uh, the RPA for your user action, for example. You have seen uh, on the demo, you have opening email attachment. You have logging and navig navigating application. You have uh, filling form. You have also extracting structured data from document. And uh, you can also creative moving and deleting uh, file on folder. You can copy and pasting data. You can fill in, you can reading and writing to database. You can following simple decision and rule by if them. You can collecting statistics from social media, from uh, other database, and so on. And you can connect it to system application program interface. It's more complicated. It's more, you need more adjustment. You can make calculation with, uh, with RPA. And you can scrapping data from the web uh, to put uh, on some web. And uh, in the future, you can add more and more uh, capability. And in terms of system, normal, uh, you can interact uh, uh, RPA capability with uh, Excel, OpenOffice, Word, IDMPR, SAP, uh, Microsoft Dynamic. You can uh, uh, use a CSV file, JSON file, legacy, uh, legacy machine, database, email, Firefox, uh, Chrome, IDMPR, and Citrix. You have a lot of uh, capability to, uh, to, to, you, to use this kind of application and to automatize some tasks on, 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 on all this uh, system, uh, system, uh, uh, system. The pros of RPA we, uh, and the advantage, uh, sometimes it's just technical and commercial uh, vision because uh, 27 hours operation, non-stop, never smoke, Never, never sleep, never eat, never, 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 never sick, never sick. This is uh, just in terms of commercial, not, not in terms of uh, political or something else. Cost reduction, cost approximately, you can reduce the cost from one to this for a human employee. You can improve efficiency uh, approximately three uh, to, f to 15 more efficient than manual. Quality, you increase quality because error, error and, focus, uh, and focusing on exception is uh, integrated in on the robot. You can uh, manage uh, issue, exception, and so on easily. And if you have it, it's easy to, to see the error, but if, if you are in manual, if there are no error, sometimes you don't see it and, uh, and, and you lose some data or something else. Normally, you let the, all, all, the, all the, the people that you replace with uh, RPA uh, are, more user, uh, are, are more useful for make evaluate work. This is uh, a vision. I'm not sure that, uh, that is, uh, it is a reality. Short payback period, yes, it's very easy to implement. Uh, and, uh, and the cost uh, of uh, this kind of product, uh, you have uh, ROI, uh, ROI rapidly. Scalability, you can increase, uh, increase your business uh, without uh, add more, more cost. And internal control and traceability. Uh, you can trust everything, you can, uh, you can have uh, enough uh, analytics, and you can use uh, the product that uh, Morio show, show you for to say that, uh, that is uh, that good traceability about uh, RPA. Now, uh, if you look dis disadvantage of, of RPA, all, all the tasks are not ideal for RPA. Some tasks, uh, <coughs> if you have a lot of, uh, lot of uh, manipulation or uh, reflection on, 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 on some process, RPA cannot make it. Bad process cannot be automated. 
process process change if the process change frequently each time you must be updating updating the robot and uh, it's frequently it's complicated to updating uh, the robot frequently just for for the same task uh, uh, that you use frequently in your in your in your uh, in your company human intervention if you, if you need human intervention it was complicated to mix robot and human intervention and it's similar if you need to to have intervention about uh, IT uh, and uh, something else it's 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 not uh, it's not uh, it's not useful for this for this moment RPA is not yet intelligent uh, i think about uh, uh, in artificial intelligence uh, in the future for example you see the, the pdf file that you try to keep some uh, some information on it all the information that you keep it's always in the same place for example address uh, uh, address uh, shipping address uh, shipping of uh, invoicing address it always in the same place on the pdf uh, reference uh, that you order at the same place and so on but in the future with uh, intelligence and syntactic analytic for example you can pick uh, anywhere the, in the invoice address uh, the reference uh, for, from different uh, type of PDF uh, and uh, Excel. And it's also, also uh, complex because you have uh, employee resistance. It's, it's normal because you say, okay, you have a job, you make a repetitive job, uh, I want to change your job, and uh, it's normal that you have some uh, resistance, uh, employee resistance. You have the same uh, resistance uh, when you try to implement uh, IDM Pierre on the, on the company. And uh, RPA solution need to be managed to implement it. You, you need to, uh, to find, similar to uh, implement uh, IDM Pierre, you need to find a sponsor, you need to find a leader, you need to find, uh, you need to, to, to create a team to, 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 to implement uh, RPA. Now, I just want to show you a process example. Before RPA and after RPA, for example, if you have manual logging to invoice application, manual search every day, uh, uh, today uh, invoice, manual control of invoice, post invoice, maybe after RPA you can automatic logging in your application, automatic search on today invoice, automatic control of the invoice, check for the uh, exception, error, and so on, and post the invoice. This is a process that you can automatize uh, easily, automated easily. And if you look at this, uh, average time spent for each invoice approximately two, two minutes. Average, average per day is only uh, uh, 1,000 one, one minutes, average time and so on and so on. You can see the, the result uh, with RPA and in 20 seconds you, you can, uh, you can uh, spend for each invoice and you can win a lot of time uh, every day uh, in terms of, of, uh, of process. W who are the RPA actors? The main, the main, the leader, I think you, you connect is uh, UiPath, Automation Anywhere, Blue Prism, Work fusion, nice, and there are a lot of lot of other actors on it, and maybe uh, you can uh, you you can try with uh, many uh, many uh, many of these actors. It's not w I I have made some uh, some tests with U UI Pass. It was very interesting and uh, easily to 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 to, to use it. Uh, uh, for example, uh, you, you, UI Pass has a, a community uh, product. The community product, uh, for example, you don't c you don't can use email uh, email interface, and uh, you don't have uh, uh, you can see after you don't have orchestrator to manage. You don't have uh, you must be use a, a cron tab to run it. But you can uh, you can create a, a robot with uh, community uh, UI Pass. And for, for the rest, many of, many of them and, uh, have a community, uh, com community product. Repeat again. And architecture for each, for example, it's for UiPath. 
it's always the same. You have uh, a tool similar to the studio. You can create uh, your robot. You, you can create, uh, it's based on workflow, on seconds, uh, similar if you, you design, your, you design your, your process and what you want to make. And you have also frequently uh, a, recorder, a recorder option. You can, uh, you can make the task and the system record your, your, your movement, everything that you made, and create directly the code uh, that you can uh, modify, ch check for exception and so on. But you, uh, it's very interesting to, to have it. After you have robot, or boat, depends on the, the name. It's just an agent. It's a compiled agent, hard-coded agent, that you can put uh, on your machine to execute the task. And, and, and for, for example, uh, for UI pass, you can use cron tab. Uh, if you use uh, the community uh, system, you can use cron tab to run frequently uh, the robot uh, that you have created. And, and the main, uh, the main uh, uh, supplier have management, management tool. Uh, they perform uh, statistic, manage, manage, manage queue, manage uh, exception, manage everything. If you have many robots, for example, you have uh, 10 or, or 20 robots to manage, you, you can use a specific interface uh, to, to, to see if robot uh, run correctly, not run, you restart again, and, and so on. And all the, all the uh, main major suppliers have this kind of architecture. Now, if you want to implement uh, a RPA project, you have five steps. The first step <coughs> is identify, evaluate, and pro prioritize <laughs> processes. Sorry, excuse me. And uh, after you can describe the process, very, very uh, uh, step by step. You design and develop and test the process. It's a more funny uh, task. Implement the process and mon monitoring and uh, change and uh, improve uh, your process. Uh, sorry, not in good, not in good sense. For example, I would, I want, I would like to show uh, you a simple uh, example of to identify, evaluate, or prioritize the, pro the process. You, for example, you have post invoice process and you have reconciliate bank, bank account process. You must be check what is the trigger of the, the process. It is time, it is date, it is what is it exactly. And after you de describe each step of the process. You describe logging application, search invoice, control invoice, post invoice, close application, and you try to estimate the number of hours spent for this process yearly. And after you estimate the potential for if you can automatize or, or not, automate or, or not. For example, if you have uh, uh, some uh, interaction with human, you must be check if it is uh, if you need it, and in this case, you may decrease the percentage of, uh, of, the, of the automation potential. And after, you can uh, see uh, all the system that the, the process interact with. You can see interact with invoice application like uh, Idem Pierre, and you can, uh, you, you can see that you use Outlook, you can use uh, maybe a browser, something else, and so on. And it's a similar for the second process, reconciliant bank account. And you can, after, you can check what kind of process you can, uh, you, you can choose to prioritize uh, the, the process. After, when you have choose your process, you must be described step by step, process flow, what is exactly, process fact, IT system that you want to use, process exception, business area, department affected, because it's due to the re change re resistance, you must be know everything about the process. F first step, it's design. Design, you, can, you have tool, you have C, you have studio, you can design by, by web studio. You have a workflow that you can, you can design easily. You have uh, many, many solutions to make it. You have development, it's the fun part of, uh, of, the, of the robot. And after you can test, and unique testing, functional testing, acceptance testing, it's very important, important things. 
and after you can uh, implement. Implement, uh, when you lock it, is similar to cron, uh, cron system. You say, I, I would like to run uh, each day, uh, the, uh, on each month, on the first month, first Monday, uh, every month, uh, start at 12, and so on. It's, it's, it's a cron, uh, cron system. And after you mod monitoring the system, ensure that the process uh, runs smoothly and uh, that the output is correct. Check the robo log and report to see that it is correct also. Uh, make some K KPI to see uh, if it is uh, if it is real that you 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 win some time to create it. Check just dashboard. Make non-critical and minor adjustment. And after you can try also to improve your your process by identify process improvement by evaluate process improvement proposal establish some change prioritize what change uh, to make first and implement change. This is the last, uh, the last step for implement this kind of, of project. You can see some user case about this. If you go on this blog or if you or Google on if you, if you uh, on Google search if, if you write 35 RPA use case, you have, uh, you have uh, a lot of uh, s case that you can use and, and it's open mind, uh, open mind uh, process that you can, we can see uh, if you look this kind of example. This is finish. This is just a, a vision of about RPA. I think, uh, I, think I, I have tried to open your, your mind and to see what you can make with uh, this kind of, uh, of product. Thank you for your attention. <laughs>